Hi guys, I'm Jens. I'm Tony. And we are talking about C log today. Why are we using C log and why are we using C log and why are we going against the trend? Everybody on YouTube is telling people not to shoot in C log. Are they? They are. We don't know why. That's silly. Yeah, it is silly because we like to go against the trend to start with. Is that with. generally people who are using Canon? I should rephrase uh, shooting in lock in general. They think that's okay. something you shouldn't do on YouTube. Um, but there's a lot of people who shoot in lock because they kind of want to show their cinematic experience and, and what they have learned in the last few years. And they're B-roll masters, if you like. So they are specifically saying for YouTube, do not, is it for this kind of? Yeah, I guess so. And if you look at our other videos, we basically got into the YouTube game just half a year ago, not even four months ago, and learning off everything about the camera and the gear and, and the audio and the lighting. And recently we discovered C-Log and we think it's actually really good to use. I know that C-Log is designed for a certain dynamic range. When you go out and shoot, you have a better dynamic range and you also can use more than one camera. So you have the same picture profile when you're on a shoot with separate cameras or with several cameras, right? So that's what C-Log is for. And that gives you a certain color gradability, if you like. You have a better contrast, a better range. You have more options after in, in post-production. So what videos have you used C-Log on? We have used all of our latest product videos. If you go back to okay. the headphones, the Mixter headphones, to the Holy High headphones, the Beats here, these are, are all shoot. Uh, this are one on? is now in C-Log, okay. basically. This one is now in C-Log. And, and by the way, C-Log doesn't work for every single occasion, right? There are certain occasions uh, our last video, uh, we did C-Log and I used the uh, LUT from Potato Jet. And I think oh, yeah. it worked well outside, but I didn't think it worked well inside the car that well, the, well, not to my I, standards. I wasn't overthrown by yeah. that one. So it's a learning curve for us. So if you look at that in a, in a bigger picture, C-Log, we're using C-Log in a controlled environment. Outside, we still have to learn. Right? if we should use it or not. The reason why we use C-Log or why I started using C-Log is not just to see what the colors, uh, what the color is like afterwards and what you can do in post, post-production, mm -hmm. but also it makes my workflow easier because if I, well, yeah, yeah do, now I have certain settings I basically learned and I'm applying them. I put them in Final Cut, we're using Final Cut, and I put my LUT on, I tweak it a bit, and my entire footage, whether that be 10 minutes, whether that be 20 minutes, looks all the same. So what yeah. kind of difference can you see between using a color than a, a sorry, a C-Log flat profile yeah. and not the C-Log in I your think, videos? Yeah, so the, the best way to explain it, and I don't know if that makes any sense, is that you, when you don't shoot in C-Log, you have a certain sharpness. You're really, really sharp and crisp and crystal clear picture. You don't have that same, I think, the same, I've, that's my feeling and the way I look at it, you don't have the same extreme clear picture on a color graded C-Log, but you have more details. Don't know if that makes any sense. You so have it's more details in the softer. more- softer. It is slightly softer, but you have- The colors. The colors that you have, and that's probably the dynamic range. The dynamic range is black and white, right? So you have the, the color grading makes it way more interesting afterwards. The only downside of C-Log is our analog footage that it's basically capturing all the data and it is huge, massive data, right? So sometimes you have a hundred gigabyte for a 15 minute video. But the outcome afterwards, it's really cool though. When you look at it, when you see what can be done, it's fun, right? So how about the difference between my videos now, yeah. which don't use C-Log, yeah and this video sat in the same controlled environment, yeah. what would be the difference between the two? You are using the EOS RP and I'm yes. using the EOS R. So you have a the HD, full HD picture that's coming out. It's a, it's a lower picture quality in general. So there will be a difference anyway. Okay. So what we should do is we should look at that footage here, the C-Log footage, Ooh. and should look at the normal HD settings footage on the EOS R camera right now. Three, two, one, you're back in the room. <laughs> <laughs> now we're back in the 4K all eye profile picture. So that is the better profile picture you can have on a Canon camera that captures way more data than your HD on your EOS R. P, okay. Right? So now we can see the difference. Maybe the difference is really you can't tell or maybe it's much better this way. So can you see a difference? 
Yeah, so let us know. What do, you, what do you think about the footage you see now since we switched? And what about the footage you saw before? Do you think the colors are different? Do you think it is more sharp now? Do you think there's more details before? Uh, some of you guys asked what we are actually using. And we're using the Canon EOS R and c -Log. And then we apply a lot afterwards and then we do some tweaking and then we're done, right? So this is pretty cool. Yeah. Right. So let us know what do you think about this picture quality? Should we continue shooting in C-Log? Well, if you say no, we will anyway. Are but we in C-Log now? No. <laughs> <laughs> So, okay. so is it good or is it not good? Is it good? Is it not good? Let us know in the comments below. Thumbs up if you like it. Subscribe if you loved it. Jens here from Also Space. Tony, the card geek. Canon EOS R, c -Log. That was all about our experience with c -Log. Let us know if you have any experience with c -Log or any log footage in general. Peace out. You are using, you are using me. <laughs> what am I using? <laughs> You are using the... <laughs> so you are using... <laughs> what am I using? <laughs> okay, one, so what two. What am I using? Three, two, one, you're back in the room. <laughs> <laughs> I hate to punch my dick.